Hello everyone, welcome to GK Today. In today's video, we are going to discuss what are the different types of cyclones and how they are named. But before moving further, let me tell you that this topic is a part of your GS paper 1 syllabus pertaining to cyclones and important geophysical phenomena. So let's start our video. First of all, we will understand what is a cyclone. The term cyclone is derived from the Greek word cyclos, which means coiling of the snake. Cyclones are created by atmospheric disturbance around a low pressure area and they are usually accompanied by violent storms and severe weather conditions. Basically, a tropical cyclone is a deep low pressure area. There are two types of cyclones. The first one is a tropical cyclone and the other one is the extra tropical cyclone also called temperate cyclones or middle latitude cyclones or frontal cyclones or wave cyclones. And now if we talk about the tropical cyclones then tropical cyclones are given many names in different regions of the world. For example they are known as typhoons in the China Sea and Pacific Sea hurricanes in the West Indian Islands and the Caribbean Sea and Atlantic Ocean, tornadoes in the Guinea Island of West Africa and Southern USA, willy willies in Northern Western Australia and tropical cyclones in the Indian Ocean. In India, tropical cyclones originate over the Bay of Bengal, Arabian Sea and the Indian Ocean. These tropical cyclones have very high wind velocity and heavy rainfall and hit the Indian coastal states of Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh, West Bengal, Odisha and Gujarat. Let me tell you that these five states in India are more vulnerable to cyclone disaster other than any state in India. Now we will understand how the cyclones are named. Cyclones are named to help people remember them easily as technical terms are difficult to memorize. In the beginning, the cyclones were named arbitrarily. For instance, an Atlantic storm that right off the mast of a boat named Antje becomes known as the Antje's hurricane. And in the late 19th century, cyclones were named after Catholic saints. In 1953, these cyclones were named after women as the ships were always referred to as a female and often given women's name. In 1979, male names were introduced and at present, the cyclones are named systematically. And in the recent time, the process of naming cyclones involves several countries in the region and it is done under the ages of the World Meteorological Organization. Let me tell you that the worldwide there are six regional specialized meteorological centers and five regional tropical cyclone warning centers mandated for issuing advisories and naming of the tropical cyclones. And the tropical cyclones forming over different ocean basins are named by their concerned regional specialized meteorological center. Let me tell you that the Indian Meteorological Department is also one of the six regional specialized meteorological centers to provide tropical cyclones and storm surge advisories to 13 member panel countries under the World Meteorological Organization panel. And for Indian Ocean region, a formula for naming cyclones was agreed upon in 2014. Recently, Hudhud, Titli, Pitai, Feni, Bayu and Amphan are the cyclones originated in the Indian Ocean region. So this is all about the topic. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.